We will. We will. I mean, the whole fire department was, re, was recalled this morning, and uh, we were stationed in the ferry terminal. And then we were sh we had to go back to our own company. Not everyone. A lot of companies are here. They were able to get onto the ferry and uh, just do whatever they could to uh, you know, assist in the situation. But the, um, well, actually, I wasn't on the scene the whole time, so maybe you could ask one of the other personnel. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Because you know? okay. I was down the ferry terminal. Yeah. We just got we, we just sent the whole bus load of uh, other people. Out. Yeah. What's that? If you go up to the command post, I'll give you a slate. Yeah, no, you know what, I'm just looking for some personal stories about... about yeah, that I, can't, I can't believe, I could give you a ton, man, you couldn't even... I can't, I can't, you know, we're all gag, we're all gag, gag order, you know? Can't say anything. You can't say anything, even about just what, what, what yeah. how this feels to be. Are you with the New York Fire yes. Department? How long have you been a uh, I'm in my 10th year. 10th year. But if, if you go up here, yeah. go to Exposure 1 in the collapse zone, you'll see uh, an area there, and yes, there are some working media there. Uh -huh. I think you'll get the kind of statements you're looking to get. The real stories you want, I, I just can't get them to you. I just, you know, we're gagged. Gagged. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. But there'll be more stories unfolding as sunrise comes up. Yeah, for sure, for sure. This has got to be about the worst thing you've ever seen, I think. It's up there. It's up were you there. down here during the, um, the 93 bombing? Yes, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. I know no comparison, no comparison. Other than volume. Other than volume. Initial volume of people. But with a well-planned, executed MCI tactic program that we do here in the five boroughs in New York, we handle it with no guilt, within due fashion, in rapid fashion, with quick triage, and excellent resources that we have, yeah. we can pull it off. I know that, um, you know, in 93, the word was that that's what they wanted to do, was collapse into a tower. And I remember at the time thinking, oh my God, yeah. can you imagine if they had been successful? And, I mean, this is... Uh, the thing with the collapse of a structure that high, as high as the building sits, when it collapses, the rubble wash that comes out, in this case, most of it is a pancake collapse, which is on top of each other. Well, I'm sure, because you probably have a lot of voids inside these buildings, you know what I'm saying? Voids, where people can be in there. It takes a little time to get into them. What, what right now is your, your mission right here now? Right now, we're waiting for people to be extracted from that rubble pile. As soon as they're extracted, we'll be triaged here, given necessary fluids. Well, it's done piece by piece. If you look over in the next aisle, and I'll send you to, you'll see the heavy equipment over there. Okay. That heavy equipment is literally going to start to disentangle the building, the, the victims from the building. Okay. Okay. Yeah. What time did you get down here today? Got here this afternoon. This afternoon. Yeah, into so the event, into the event. Uh -huh. So what, was your first, all day. what was your first thought when you walked into the scene? Enter in a controlled, organized state and leave the same way. I'm sorry? Enter in a controlled, organized state and leave the same way. That's what we're doing. Okay. But I mean, what was your first reaction when you, when you... Take your training and put it to work. That's what the city's paying you to do. You didn't have a moment of just utter horror or did you just go right to work? No, because I came in from the Bronx, so I had time to think it over. And you just think of all the stuff you learn when you go into the academy. And your constant, constant update training for terrorism attacks on a city of this size. You use a, a training as a tool in route to this location. And then you execute it when you come on location, which is what everybody's doing today. Right. So when you first got here, your, your immediate thought as far as what you needed to do with what? Do what, do what I was told to do and go to the designated areas I've been dispatched to to set up. Right now we're just waiting for it. Like I said, if you go down to that command post, you'll probably get the real legit. You know, I, 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 I'd love to give it to you. Yeah, no, I understand. You know, I want to work here next week and the week after. You're, are you from New York originally? No. I live in New Jersey, but I work in the New York right, city right. of New York. Are you from New Jersey? Yeah, from way New up York. in the mountains, a nice, peaceful area. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What do you think, I mean, you know, the question to everyone, when you wake up tomorrow and you look at the New York skyline and it's not going to be there. It's changed forever. 
you pick up and rebuild. And this city will. Now, but you've got to also feel, because I don't know what the numbers are, a staggering number of firefighters lost their lives. Yeah, it hurts, you know. But uh, I, I think if you stay focused on, on the mission you're out here to do, you'll be able to do that. It's the top of the game. And then later on when it hits you, then you get together and you work it out. But right now, there's really no time for that. No time to even think about not even a, not even a, a Have moment. Names started circulating amongst you, um, rumors, yeah, rumors, rumors are out. You know, nothing's confirmed. A lot of dead, but you know, nothing's confirmed. I think when you see what you're going to see down the street of the emergency service vehicles that are gutted and blown apart, it's going to be mind-boggling. You know what I'm saying? It, it's quite uh, a surreal uh, thing. You'll see it. You'll see it. You'll see it. But uh, yeah, I wish I could say, well, I, I could say one thing. Thanks for the resources that came in from the surrounding areas, including the great state of New Jersey, uh, Nassau and Suffolk. I believe there's Connecticut resources here, Pennsylvania resources here. And through the three stages of mobilization, all the years that they've been doing this, it pays off, man. You dial one phone number and everybody shows. Not a bad deal. Thanks for talking to us. Okay. How long do you think you'll be here now? I think I'm here until uh, Sunday.